Yeah. Good. I feel a real yeah. master of the mandolin. Whoops. Well, I would have right. done if that hadn't slipped out there. The lemon's almost there. Right. So when did you develop this? This, well, I've just played around with a combination of uh, flavours. Mm -hmm. um, that fennel can go in there, Matthew. OK. Straight in there, please. And th this one here, you see, we yeah. just put in the breadcrumbs. Yes, now, those breadcrumbs look, don't look like the sort of thing you buy in packets from the supermarket. So these are space here. You call them Japanese. No, they're called no. Japanese. Yeah, and what's so special about them? Well, the Japanese, they're actually, they're shaved bread. I've yeah. got some here that the oysters, I've pushed them That's in before oh, yeah. to keep them cool. Just about ten minutes before, and it just doesn't dry out the moisture, it just has a nice gentle coating. I see. Do you get them in some Japanese, special Japanese um, kitchen shops or food shops and things like uh, that? You can or buy them really um, anywhere, even in supermarkets. Really? Days, yeah. God, I've never they're, seen they're them. They're very readily available, I have to say. I'm going to give you a few more slices okay. of this. A I few think, more slices of that in there. Okay, fine. Anyway, I'm just going to chop a bit of and, and what happens to them, say, why is it, what is the quality of Japanese breadcrumbs that makes them particularly suitable for your uh, for this dish, do you think? Uh, we, see, with the Japanese breadcrumb, what happens is, mm -hmm. when you fry it, Matthew, yeah. it doesn't stay, uh, it doesn't soak up the fat. Mm -hmm. What it actually does is, it just um, crispens, but then the fat runs off. Because because they're shaved, they're shards. Yeah, oh, I see, yeah. So they're not, they don't soak up the fat. The, yeah. They're very dry. So and they, they, just, they get really crunchy. Yeah, they get incredibly crunchy. Crunchy and munchy. And, and, that will, and not oily. And that will... And that, that makes will, an enormous whoops. difference. Yeah. And that will sort of contrast with the other elements in the... Um, uh, well, it just keeps it clean and fresh. Is that going to be enough? Yeah, it's enough. So what oh, we do great. is we put the vine vinaigrette on this now. Yeah, that and vinaigrette, and that's made up of just olive oil? Olive oil, white wine vinegar. White wine seasoning. vinegar, a bit, a bit of seasoning. salt on there. And nothing else. Why has it, it come all sort of emulsified like that? Just because it's been shaken fast. By a real shaken, chef -y shaken not stirred. Mm -hmm.